Hey guys, so today's video is going to be my updated vanity and makeup storage kind of thing. It's not really like a collection. I'm not going to go through each piece. It is just kind of like a storage kind of um, video today showing you my new storage. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you know that I went to Ikea a couple months ago and I got a new vanity because I hated how I had it before when I first moved in here. And um, I've been really playing with it a lot. It took me a really long time to get it the way I wanted it to, of course. Um, but I finally got it set up and I love the way I have it set up. I went through and I threw away and gave away so much old stuff that I wasn't using and that I didn't need. So I'm really excited about that because I feel like I'm free a little bit and there's a lot less um, stuff and clutter right now. I also want to tell you guys, I do have a new camera right now, which is why I keep looking up because now I have a little screen I can look at, which is going to be bad. <laughs> but um, yeah, so I have a new camera now. So um, if you're noticing the quality's better, I hope you are noticing the quality's better from what it looks like in the screen, it looks better, so let's hope. So that is what I'm doing today. Really hope you guys enjoy. This is gonna be long enough, so I'm not gonna make this a real long intro. So thank you guys so much for watching and subscribing. I hope you enjoy this video, and if you wanna see everything, then please keep on watching. All right, so I'm starting out with um, this section right over here. So this is the same, um, the same thing I've been using for a real long time. You guys have seen this a million times before. So currently at the top I have this box or basket here. It has my palettes, those MAC extra palettes. I just set them here because I'm currently selling them so I just have them here to have. And then in there I have, you know, lotions and various body sprays type things. I have a little uh, room spray right there. Um, have my little decorations and a bag of emptiness. So first drawer, and this is definitely a lot more organized than it was last time for sure. So this first drawer right here, I have single shadows and pigments. And what I did was I gave myself a lot more room in here, didn't pack things so tight. So this way I was able to do um, a lot more. So I gave myself a lot more organization. So what I have it as now is like color coded. So basically the two front boxes here, um, this is um, single shadows um, that are neutrals. And so these are actually pressed eyeshadows. These are all the pressed. And then these are the neutrals that are loose. So pigments and stuff. And all these vary brands, um, lots of MAC, lots of bare minerals um, of the shadows and um, lots of various drugstore. I do actually have a lot of drugstore in here as well as other randomness. So that's just neutrals. And then back here I have purples and I have purple single shadows and purple pigments and also kind of a couple pinky kind of things because I just have a couple random like pinky things. So I have um, couple MAC pigments. I have um, more bare minerals and then a lot of my singles. Let's see, I have lots of Lancome purple, um, my sugar pill, and then some Make It Forever and another MAC one. And then right back here, I have my greens and blues and that consists of my sugar pill, some obsessive compulsive cosmetics, a MAC, Urban Decay, Randomness, um, and that's the also pigments and uh, pressed shadows. So next drawer. This drawer I dedicated to palettes. Um, I could have put all this in with these shadows, but like I said, I had more room because of the way I've organized it now. So I wanted it to be more spaced out. So now I have room that when my collection grows, if it does grow more, um, I'll have more room in here to put even more palettes. But this way it's really organized and easy to see. And that's what I wanted. So up front here, I have lots of drugstore palettes. These are all Wet n Wild. And then these are all my um, Lancome palettes from various uh, free gift with purchases. And then I have one full-size Lancome palette here. I have my Naked 2 palette, as well as my Kat Von D, my big Wet n Wild, and my Norse palette. And then I just stuck my extra beauty blender in here, just because I didn't really have anywhere else to put it, and there was space there, so I figured that'd be easy just to stick it there. Next, I have in here, just like um, the rest of my eye products. So in here, I put my mascaras, and I threw away probably 20 mascaras for seriously. I have just random mascaras, drugstore, and high-end. And then I also have all my brow 
products right here. Again, drugstore and high-end. I have here my just cream bases. So these are all pots. So I have a bunch of MAC paint pots, a bunch of color tattoos. Those are real amazing. And then I'll have like, um, underneath I have random gel liners and things like that. And I kind of stick the ones I use more on the top here. Um, and then here I have my cream bases that are in stick form though. So stick forms as well as like primers, like these, you know, my usual primers. Um, and then also like little wand kind of things and my elf stick um, cream shadows. I love these. All right. And then this last section back here is all eyeliners. So there are pencils um, and liquid eyeliners back here. And I also have my Laura Mercier eyeliner cake and eyeliner activator back here. Again, this is another one of the things I threw a lot away and gave a lot away to my mom. <laughs> so that's that. This next drawer is my lips. So I'm not a real huge lip person. Um, you guys know I kind of like to do the same thing that I like. I'm trying to branch out a little more, but you guys, obviously, you know, I like what I like. But anyways, so these are all of my lipsticks almost. I have a couple random ones that are just, you know, in my purse or in my um, wallet and stuff. Just ones I use every day. But these are all of my lipsticks pretty much. And I have them organized by brand. So it goes from MAC to Lancome to Estee Lauder to drugstore okay and then in here I have my lip glosses and also like my lip balm things I don't have too many lip glosses I got more recently that I just kind of realized I had more but I really don't have too many and then I have some OCC lip tars I have all these Estee Lauder because the lady at the Estee Lauder counter I work at she gave me two gifts when I bought my foundation and stuff during their last free gift so I have like lots of Estee Lauder little mini lip glosses and then I have these are all Lancome Juicy Tubes in various colors whoops and then back here I have lip liners you can see this is a very sad <laughs> little basket I really don't use too many different colors I mean I have my nude my different color nudes the stuff I would use on brides and as well and then I have my various reds because that's really the only other kind of lip liner I use is either red or nude pretty much so I have red and nude and then like a brighter pink that's pretty much all I use so this last small drawer is um, nails and skincare so this is all my nail polish I really don't have a lot of nail polish because I never paint my nails okay so these are all OPI here I have some Tula Masca some Victoria's Secret a random Estee Lauder other randomness and then I love these these are my favorite the um Sally Hansen extreme wear focus 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 I'm still getting used to this new camera guys Sally Hansen extreme wear um, love these ones these are like my favorites and they're only like $2.99 which is awesome um, I have usually a nail polish remover right here but I just used it this morning um, but I have some extra Bure cleansing strips nail file and then this is just extra skincare stuff so this is all my extra um, currently. These are stuff I would usually use on a regular basis, but I'm not using that right now because I'm experimenting with coconut oil. So that's why it's in there. Here is how it's always been a mess. Just random tools, random hair stuff, bag of jewelry, like extra tools, extra little skincare samples. It's just a mess in there. In here I have makeup bags down here again is randomness this is where I used to hold my everyday makeup um, and then I just have random things for like kit kind of stuff like these I will put I put my um lipsticks in whatevs and then the bottom drawer is just you're probably like what I used to have my pencils in these before I moved and I've kind of switched up how I hold my art supplies so I stuck these in here because I know where else to put them and then this is one of the little drawers from my um, train case so that's that. So now we go over here and this is the last part of my vanity. So here I have um, in this box I have just hair stuff. All my hair stuff. Tools, excuse me, um, hair brushes, hair spray, all that kind of stuff. Um, trash can that is totally full. I have my mirror. What up though? Um, back here I have my coconut oil and my Urban Decay spray. These are some dirty brushes. And then I have my brushes all right here in these cups. I separate them by like synthetic foundation-y type brushes, powder brushes, small eye brushes, 
fluffy brushes, flat brushes, <laughs> small cheek brushes, and then duo fiber brushes. That's how that's done, and I like it. Right over here, I'm sorry if you can hear from the window, guys, but it's extremely hot in here. Right here, I have my palettes and this little, um, Mazine, ma Mazine, I'm an idiot, magazine <laughs> organizer. So, um, and I decided to change this up too. So basically how I have it now is neutrals of MAC and Inglot, blues of MAC and Inglot, and I did get a palette just for the blues because I figured those were probably going to expand since I got that new job and I'm going to be naughty. Um, and then um, these are purples right here, both um, MAC and Inglot, and I'm going to break something. And then here I have my Z palette with my Estee Lauder and Lancome blushes, my MAC blush palette, and then my Inglot lipstick palette. Alrighty, here's my little chair, and I'm going to sit down. Okay, so this thing has a whole big drawer, and this is where I put all my face stuff. So in there, it's all my eyes and lips, and then in here, it's my face. Starting over here, if you look back here, there's a basket. This is full of random foundations that I didn't want to throw away quite yet, but I don't use on a regular basis. So it's back there, and that's got like L'Oreal True Match, a couple of our Sheer Glow, so lots of double wear light from Estee Lauder and that random stuff. Um, here are like concealers. So I have, you know, my all my Pro Longwear concealers in here for different shades for different people. Um, more random concealers, and then I also have random primers like NARS Primer, Illuminators, more primers, more illuminators, that kind of thing. In here, I have more foundations, but stuff I use more often. So I have lots of double wear in here. I have all my Pro Long Wear in here, just so I could have it right in here, just in case when I need to use it on others. And then I have my CoverGirl foundation, that Outlast a Fabulous Fab foundation. Okay. Um... I have all my extra powders here, so that ranges from some Double Wear, some Lancome, MAC Translucent, my extra MSFs for use on other people, Studio Fix, Estee Lauder Double Wear, some more stuff like that. This middle container here is all more like my daily face stuff. So my daily MSF, my daily bronzer, you guys know, excuse me while I fix that. Um, I also have my Rimmel Stay Matte. I have my Revlon Color Stay 320, Well Rested, my um, CoverGirl Corrector, and then my Daily Use Concealer, my MAC Pen that I like to use a lot. This is my Face Concealer from L'Oreal, and then two primers I really like, which is Labasse Pro from Lancome and Primetime from Bare Essentials, and just my little palette thing. Over here, I have blushes split up into two sections. So these are just single blushes. So like I said, I have more blushes back here. I don't have too many single blushes because um, I hate things being single. That's why you see I have so many palettes because I hate single things. So um, I just have randomness. So right in this drawer here, these are peachy and neutral blushes. So all of these have maybe a peachy to ready undertone or they're more like just natural brownie undertones and then in here I have my pinks and my um, purples all in here so that's that over here I have bronzers and highlighters so I've I only own two highlighters guys and that's all I need I don't need like five million highlighters and stuff you feel me okay I have my bronzers this is a blush slash bronzer, but it's real big, so I just put it here. My Wonder Woman thing that's bronzer, blush, and highlighter. Boom. Here I have tools I use on a daily basis, so I'll always clip my hair back, which I need to do apparently in more videos because you guys get mad at me. And then I have, you know, tweezers, eyelashes, lash glue, blah, blah, blah. And then in here I have more clips, makeup remover, my little sponges, hand sanitizer, and, um tape for when I do my cray looks you already know and that's all she wrote guys pretty simple stuff so let me give you a little let me push that in let me give you a little pan around so it's right here boom real easy and then this right here fun stuff so that is it thank you guys so much for watching again Thank you for subscribing. I appreciate it so much, and I will see you next time. Bye.